Hello, in this video I will show you how can you bulk upload product images into Shopify. So here I have a couple of products and uh, none of these uh, products has uh, images. So, and I have my images inside Google Drive. So in this solution, it uh, can be Google Drive or Dropbox, but uh, for this video, I will be using uh, Google Drive. And uh, here I want to match all of these images uh, with the SKUs of my products. So as you see here in my example product, I have here SKU V8 orange. And if I go to my Google Drive, you can see my image name actually contains V8 orange. So this is how I'm going to match uh, my images with products. Uh, Basically, I will uh, choose the option which will match images based on uh, if they are containing SKU. So let's see how we are going to do this. For this, we are going to use a Smart Image uh, Upload app. This is the app uh, developed by my company and uh, uh, it works with the Google Drive, Dropbox uh, and uh, many different uh, matching options. So first of all, let's connect uh, our Google Drive account. First, we click here. We choose the account. And then we this is very important to select this. Uh, and then we say continue. Now we just uh, need to select the folders so in my case it's uh, folder name is 2025 demo so i'm going to choose that folders 2025 demo yeah, this folder and 74 images inside this folder so my matching option i'm going to choose if image contains sku and then uh, if I already would have some images and I would like to replace them, I will choose this option. But in this example, I don't have any images already, so I just don't need to replace anything. So we are going to start matching here. And as you see, uh, I have 74 images, all of them matched uh, based on SKU. And you can see, for example, this product is matched with this product because SKU of this product was this and it was so if I do like this you can see V8 orange so you can see it matched all of the different images and also based on their positions that's also very important detail so I have many images for uh, each variant and uh, I want the uh, these positions to be uh, based on like uh, underscore one should be my first image uh, underscore two should be my second image so basically here this is my first image and let's go this is my second image this is my third image so basically, uh, the logic is that you can use underscore and numbers to decide what's going to be the position of this image uh, inside the product. So now we are ready to uh, starting upload. We just need to click on start upload button. And it actually will start uh, uploading in the background. So and it will give us an information about uh, which image uh, uploaded to which product and also we are automatically assigning uh, alt text here so it's uh, good for SEO purposes and uh, yes uh, I will uh, speed up the video uh, to make sure this uh, finish it uh, Okay, now is uh, upload is about to finish. And yes, it's finished now. So it seems like all images uh, has been successfully uploaded. Let's check our products now. So if we go to our product page again, 
I can see already images are here. Uh, so let's visit uh, our product pages and see. So images are uploaded here correctly. And they are also assigned to the correct variants uh, uh, correctly. That's very important uh, detail because uh, you want to always show uh, correct variant images based on selected products uh, and based on selected variant on the page. So that's very important detail. So images also assigned to variants. We can check one more example, probably this uh, boots, which is more complex product. This one also is assigned correctly. So you can see here. And uh, yes, basically this is uh, how the app works. This is uh, I'm developer behind this app, and uh, this is uh, uh, the app that we built to make your life easier. So it works with Dropbox and Google Drive. You can change also source uh, here to Dropbox and tr try that as well. We are also uh, have diff many different uh, matching options, like for example meta fields. You can also match products based on uh, their barcodes uh, that's that's also possible like for example if we go to the variants uh, you can see we have here barcode as well that's also possible to match based on that field this field based on uh, title of the products uh, and also uh, meta fields of the product all these are possible and if your images or uh, your uh, products and images somehow related we will help you also to uh, make matching possible it doesn't have to be perfect sometimes uh, uh, SQs may contain some extra characters or uh, image names may contain some extra files so that's very important to uh, make sure that uh, they are matching uh, together so we will make that uh, uh, possible for you by, and we will help you to match them actually based on some customizations that we have and uh, yeah everything is uh, possible with this app you can see also the app page itself as well here and uh, yes thank you very much for uh, watching uh, and uh, please uh, feel free to reach out uh, to our support and we will be uh, happy to help you uh, to save you time by uploading all the product images. Uh, have a great day.